Hey, what's up guys? I got a quick video on this mini micro SD card reader. This is from a Kickstarter project. I'm pretty sure most of you guys have actually heard about this. And I already went ahead and opened it to save you guys the trouble of watching me fail on video. So, I don't know how to open this. Just Okay, so just simple packaging, I guess. Don't really care about that. You get a keychain, a USB adapter. So this is a USB to micro USB, which is actually kind of cool. You never really see any of those. So I'm pretty sure you can use that for more than just this little device. But the main part about this is that I have my 32 gig SD card here. There we go. Just put it in just like that. And we can pop off the cap and see we have a, pretty sure you guys can see that. We have a micro USB port. So let's see if it'll work on something with a case. So I have my trusty piece of crap HTC One here. I'm gonna go ahead and plug it in. Getting a phone is in USB host mode. All right, whatever that is. But see, we can go to. I don't know. HTC doesn't have like a file explorer, so that's kind of. But you see that the device itself is actually blinking blue. So I probably should have installed something like ES File Explorer, but you know, too much. Effort. So if we go to storage, it's going to calculate, and if we go down to USB storage, you see I have 8 gigs free out of 27, I mean 29. So you see that it does work. So if you're like me and you have too many devices, <laughs> you can actually transfer, say you have a song on this SD card, but you want it on this phone, you can just go ahead and do that. Or say that you're running out of storage and you're going on a trip, you can load up a 64 gig, like the one in my camera, and you can put like, I don't know, 30 something movies on there. Then you can have tons of music and pictures or whatever. Like you can take pictures. Because I mean this, it's not, it's on there. It's not going anywhere. So you can hold this and you can take all the pictures you want and store those pictures on your little SD card. So you can have all those videos and stuff on the trip. And I mean it's just a really handy device. So I will have a link below to, I think you can buy these if you're not a backer. But they're only like 15 bucks, something like that. But I mean, they're a really neat device for something like, say, get this in here, my HTC Droid DNA. This only has 16 gigabytes of internal memory. And about, I think, four or five is already taken up by Sense, the UI. So I only have about 12 gigs, actually, that I can use. And if you download an app like Need for Speed or Asphalt 8, those games are like two gigabytes each. So... I've installed two games and I'm already down to almost six gigabytes. Um, that's not a really a, anything if you guys want to like have you know music and videos on there. So this at least has 32 gigabytes. But if you guys get the 64 gig SD card and you get this, you guys can actually tra travel around with this in your pocket, and it won't break off or because I mean, you see it's pretty stable. I mean it's on there. I'm not really sure how to get this into focus, but I'll just do this. But, I mean, you see it's on there. It's not going anywhere. It's there, I guess you would call it. But if you didn't want to risk that, you could go ahead and put the little cap filter thingy on it. And you guys can go ahead and apply the keychain. So I'm, I'm not going to really do that because, I mean, I just kind of like it like this. You guys can slide it in and out of your pocket and you won't have any issues at all. And it's kind of hard to remove, which I guess is a good thing, actually. So you won't have any issues with that. But see, you have your SD card in here. Go ahead and pull that out. So that's not just going to fall out either. And yeah, I mean, it's a pretty great device. I mean, $15 isn't that much for this, honestly. I mean, if you guys need something like this, I would recommend it. Um, I will post a link below. I'm not sure if I'm putting this on there the right way. I'm assuming I am because it goes like that. There we go. But, I mean, put this on your keychain or, I don't know, do whatever you want with it. But I will post a link below if I can find a link outside of just, like, the people who back this. So let me get this so you guys can actually maybe see it. But it's a pretty neat little device. It's got little LED lights on it. All you do is put your little SD card in there and get this. So, I don't know, this kind of looks awkward to me. But um, I guess you could plug this into your computer and transfer the, those movies and stuff over, unplug it, 
God, these things are just in there, aren't they? Um, that's what she said. But just unplug it, plug it into your phone, and bam. I mean, I don't really know what else to say about it. If you guys have any questions that I didn't cover, I mean, put it on this. Um, just post a comment below, and I will answer it. And, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video.